<clears throat> well, good morning, everybody. Uh, I'm still half asleep. Still half asleep. I just decided to push the broadcast button. <laughs> Reminds me of Jackie. Push that broadcast button. Get on there whether you feel like it or not. Go live if you will. Whether you feel like it or not. <laughs> Old Periscope. I miss Periscope. <clears throat> I'll tell you, if anybody, anybody says that we're not living in the last days, a lot of people, some people say that. You know, that Jesus won't return, could maybe not return for thousands of years yet. No. No. I know they say that whenever you go through struggles like we ha we ha we are, you go through trials and er everything, it only makes you stronger. Well, that it, that is true in the end, yeah. It, it, anyway, this is the 20th of October. 2024 yes we're still here we're still here the landlady is doing all she can to scare us she don't realize that we're smarter than we're smarter than she thinks she than she thinks we are you know I know I know some of the laws too I know some of the laws and my mother used to be a uh, landlady back in the 70s. And my brother is, is a retired police officer. It's just truly amazing. Again, how people can be, how people can be truly amazing all this evil going on in the world yes it's another straight talk it hurts my eyes you know to have to read to read very much it hurts my eyes people till I can finally get to the eye doctor it, it puts strain on my eyes but anyway um, it is almost six o'clock a.m. We're getting as much stuff as we can moved. We're going to take some more stuff up there today. When you have to deal with government agencies, when you have to deal with government agencies, it's no fun. It's no fun. We thought we'd be out Friday. Well, this moving company has a mailbox, you know, voicemail, and it was full. Both this other agency has approved, has approved us being moved. And the movers want to move us. But the movers, like I said, their voice, they don't keep their mailbox cleaned out. <clears throat> they don't keep the messages deleted out. And they all knew, no, and they all they all knew that we had a time schedule to be out of here. We had a, a time schedule. Just so much, you guys. Just, just so much. We'll make it. We'll make it. And a few of you have sent words of encouragement, yeah, a few, a few, very few. I've got 300 and, I forget now, 300 and, I can't remember. Try to remember. Just amazing. 
truly amazing. For this is the day that the Lord has made. Let us all rejoice and be glad therein. For weeping may endure for a moment, but joy comes in the morning. My joy is coming. My jo true joy is coming. Between that and the love of my Lord. Between that and the love of my Lord. We're just going through. Well, look what all Job went through. And the devil told him. I mean, God told the, um, the devil, he can do anything he wants to Job, but don't kill him. What all was Job plagued with? He had boils on him and uh, everything you could imagine that man went through. But he came out in the end, he came out better than ever in the end. But that's about where we're at almost, where we're at. People just don't care. People don't care. A few does, yes, a few does. Again, here we are, sitting here, wanting to be in our new home. You know, we're not pack mules. We don't, we have to have a way to get the stuff moved, the furniture and all that moved, yes. <laughs> but I'm staying in faith. This is not a, this is not a doom, doom and gloom one. It's just me straight talk. I know we will be moved. We will be moved. I don't know what all that this landlady is going to try to do to us. I don't know. I have no idea. But God will take us through it. He'll take us through it. And I'm getting, I keep getting notifications. Rapture dreams. Rapture, 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 rapture. People are deceived. People are deceived on this rapture theory thing. I believed in it too for years. I believed in it. <clears throat> there is no secret rapture. There's no secret rapture. It got started by a, a girl, Margaret McDonald, a dream that she had. And then John Nelson Darby and Schofield took it from there. That's the truth. You know, I mean, of course, again, God can do what he, God can do what he wants. Yes, <clears throat> he is God. He can do what he wants. But as far as a rapture, when it says being caught up in the air to meet Jesus, you know, and everybody, doesn't mean that he's going to take the church out. That he's going to take us out we're going to go through a lot of stuff we're going to go through a lot and i've said a lot of this before but i don't care we're going to go through a lot of stuff and it's already started it's already started and like i said it's plain the bible's playing it out page by page book by book playing it out playing it out Playing it out. People probably said, well, Gloria, you shouldn't get on there when you're feeling. Why not? It's my YouTube channel, right? I've got a right to say what I want to say or however way I feel, I've got a right. And those of you that put down the Eastern Orthodox faith, you're wrong to put it down. You're wrong. I mean, there could be some things wrong, but again, 
Nobody has everything right. Nobody has everything right. The only only thing, there's a couple of things, but the main thing that I, that I don't go along with is them saying it could be thousands of years before the Lord returns, which, which is true, but with everything going on now, the Euphrates River has dried up. There's another one. The signs before the Lord comes. The Euphrates River has dried up. So many things that points to, okay, we are in the days of sorrows. We are in the birth pangs, like a woman in travail, you know. But anyway, I love the Orthodox faith. I love the Orthodox faith. Eastern Orthodox. And you also have to be careful which your Orthodox church that you're, you know, acquainted, you know, I mean, that you're a part of, too. You know, but anyway, it's the Eastern Orthodox. I love them people. I dearly love them people. It's all biblical. And then people put down the church fathers. They say it's a bunch of malarkey. Bunch of malarkey. And yeah, some of them got some things wrong. Well, when they got things wrong, they were excommunicated. You know, they were excommunicated. But I'd much rather have the Orthodox faith than Pentecostal and, you know, Protestant beliefs. And people that get on there and speak in tongues and don't uh, um, interpret. Because yes, it, it clearly says in the, in the Word, if you speak in an unknown language, nobody knows what, what you're saying and you have to interpret it. And I do follow a couple people that speak in tongues and they don't interpret. I've done it myself. I've done it myself. Because if you don't interpret what you said, then it wasn't of God. It wasn't of God. It wasn't of God. It has to line up with the Word. It has to line up with the Word. I'm going to call this one person out. I'm going to have to, I'm going to do another video and I'm going to call her out. I love her dearly. I love her dearly. No, Yvette, it's not you. <laughs> but I love her dearly. I followed her since 2013, I think. 14. And she's a prophet. She's a prophet, a prophetess. But when, but when she's doing a broadcast and she wants everybody to start speaking in tongues, you're not supposed to do that. You know, and if you do, you're supposed to interpret or pray for pray for interpretation. So she's wrong. On open broadcast, speaking in tongues, she's wrong for doing that. People, like the Bible says, people say they're, they're crazy, they're nuts. I'm getting the heck out of there. Just so many, so many things that I'm being made aware of that the Lord, the Lord is dealing with me about, you know, downloading, downloading things to me. And yes, I found my, my ring. Faith and in the cross. Faith in the cross. It fits me now. It's a seven. Nice and loose. I couldn't wear it for the longest time, but anyway. <laughs> Sometimes I'll sit and I'll just think, you know, about all the stuff. All the times I asked for donations. My heart was in the right place, but people just thought, well, she's on there begging for money. Well, <clears throat> Yeah, I'm going in circles. Do I care? No. 
I don't care. I don't care. <laughs> Again, it's my video and it's my YouTube channel. If you don't like what what I'm saying, then you can X out. You know, go to somebody else's channel. I'm going to do the Our Father prayer. It's 10 after 6. I'm going to do the Our Father prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen and amen in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. From now and ever to all ages, amen and amen. And they all said amen. Amen. I love you all. I love you all. Thank you for watching. To those of you who are with me, thank you for watching this. While I went... We need circles. <laughs> Will the circle be unbroken? By and by, Lord, by and by. <laughs> Will the circle be unbroken? Oh, my. I'll get on here probably later on today and do, an do another video. We're planning on going up to the house, take some more stuff. And when I think about the house... I get really happy. I get really happy. Like I said, yeah. <laughs> I know there are lots of people that's going through struggles. Yes, lots of us are going through struggles. I'm not that perfect Christian. I'm the one that knows I need Jesus. And boy, that's very true coffee in Jesus oh that's good coffee mm. <laughs> but there are a lot of us that's going through struggles and if you love the Lord yes we're gonna we're gonna go through stuff but what the Lord sees is how we react to things again what he sees is what we how we react to things and yes we get in our flesh we get in our flesh we get in our flesh because we're only human we're not heavenly beings yet we're not heavenly beings yet you know we're not we don't, we're not in our glorified bodies yet you know we're going to get discouraged At times we're going to just say what what's the use what's the use but then god pulls us back up he pulls us back up out of the muck and the mire One thing I know for a fact, again, one thing I know for a fact, Protestantism is false. Protestantism is false. You can bet anything that's got an ism on it is false. Anything with an ism is usually, usually well, except baptism, that, that's not. But, you know, I think you know what I mean. Catholicism is false. But the Catholics have a lot of things right. You know, some things wrong, yes. We've got this big Orthodox or Roman Catholic church here, but I go to it, no. And good old Martin Luther strikes again. Get Martin Luther's book, uh, The Dissension of Martin Luther. Thus, all of these different denominations. And it was supposed to be one church, one church, one holy apostolic, one holy Catholic apostolic church, one church. And thanks to Martin Luther, like, like I said, all these different denominations, he started the Lutheran church, Lutheranism. He started the Lutheran church all of these different denominations 
was birthed from the Roman Catholic Church. Birthed from the Roman Catholic Church. You know, I wouldn't step foot in that church. I've been in there one, twice. One, once to a family that was murdered. Five children were murdered. I went to their funeral. That was in 1968. And then, tw then another time when a friend, a friend was used to be Catholic. She was Catholic, and she wanted to show me, you know, around a little bit. So I went in with her. All the statues and all that, you know. But I, I'm just lifting up East, Eastern Orthodoxy. I watched Vespers. I watched a video on Vespers yesterday. What's, they say, what's Vespers? It's prayers. Prayers. This was an Orthodox church in Canada. This, this, this was one in Canada. An Eastern Orthodox church in Canada. Beautiful. They sing, they sing the verses. They, they sing the scriptures. They sing the scriptures. Everything they do is biblical, right out of the Bible. Biblical. Everything they do. Yeah. I know when Joe and I went with Michael and Joyce and Jordan to, to their church down in Indiana, it was a Christmas Eve service, and it was beautiful, absolutely beautiful. And they did the incense. Jesus loves, God loves incense. He loves incense. Perfumed, anything perfumed, candles, things like that always made me sick. That didn't, that didn't at all. Just made, it just was peaceful. And I did find my frankincense and myrrh can't uh, incense. You know the sticks that you stick. I found all we found all that frankincense and myrrh, and the Lord loves that. He loves, he loves it. He loves it. Well, you guys, <laughs> if you could make heads or tails with me going in circles, Sister Cat, I'm sorry if uh, if I went in cir circles. Like I said, it is my video and. You have to just decipher, decipher some things. That I know we'll come out. We'll, we'll come out. All right. We will. We will. And yes, I do thank you so very, very much. Thanks to you and me. Well, yeah. We were able to feed. I think Steve said we was able to feed 10, 10 people. That's what it's all about. That's what it's all about. So anyway, you guys, I'm going to get off of here. Be blessed. Keep on the whole armor of God. The breastplate of righteousness, the helmet of salvation. Keep on the belt of truth, the boots of peace, the sword of the spirit, and the shield of faith. To be able to come up against the wiles of the devil. Because he roams around like a roaring lion. Seeking to whom he can may devour, and don't let it be you. Don't let it be you. Hang on to God. Hang on to His. Hang on to Jesus' hand. Hang on to His hand. Hang on to His hand. He'll take us through. He'll take us through. Amen. He'll take us through, you guys. I love you all. And I, I can't even remember how many subscribers I have. 300 or something. <laughs> but he'll take us through. If we faint not. If we faint not. <clears throat> and yes, as soon as we get settled and all that, I'm going to make another appointment to see the eye doctor. Because I do need to see him. I need, I need new, new glasses. I need new lenses. You know. So... Have a wonderful, blessed Sunday. Have a wonderful, blessed Sunday. Be kind to one another. Love one another. Lift one another up in prayer. Lift one another up. And don't knock people down. So many people knock people down. 
you know. And I would knowingly knock anybody now, down, knowingly. That's not my personality, that's not me to knock people down. That's not me. I love people. You know, I mean, I've been hurt time and time again through the years because I love people. I tried to see the good in people. You know, I've tried to see the good in people. And I've been hurt. <laughs> I've been backstabbed. <laughs> but I'll always be me. I'll always be me. So anyway, Till my next video. I love you guys. Kisses and hugs to each and every one of you. I imagine most of you will, will be able to understand what all I was rambling on about. I imagine. So. And yes, I'm still tired, but I slept good. Went to bed at... Went to bed at 11.30, I think it was, and slept till 5.30, so... Yeah, I've got two more capsules to take, two more of my antibiotics to take, and I'll be done. This ear is a lot better. Yes, it still needs cleaned out, but it's not, the infection's cleared up. Thanks for your prayers. Thanks for all your prayers, you guys. So, alrighty. To my next video.